Hello, and welcome to this InfoAssist Plus Primer on virtual fields, which can be used to create content. A temporary field's value is not stored in the data source, but can be calculated from it or assigned an absolute value. They are created as needed, and take up little storage space on the server, making them a great way to adapt your data on the fly. Suppose you find useful insight in your data that isn't directly represented by any of its fields. You can create a temporary field to bring that information to light, right alongside the rest of your data. Let's say you want to combine multiple fields into one by creating a field for city and state instead of having separate columns for each. This would be a perfect opportunity to create a define, which makes a new field from your data before its values are compiled. Open the Data tab and click Detail Define. In the Expression Builder, fields with words use the alphanumeric format. Time-related fields use the date or date-time format, and numeric fields use one of the other field formats. Let's select alphanumeric and make sure to use an adequate character limit. Now we'll set up the field to display the city and state names divided by a comma. Add customer city to the expression from the fields on the right. Within an absolute value sign, add two single quotes with a comma followed by a space between them. Now add the state slash province field. Name the field and click OK. You can find your new define field in the data pane, drag it to the report, and rename the column by right-clicking its header and selecting Change Title. Now you have city and state in one column, properly formatted. You can also create a define field for a master file when in the Edit Metadata step of the data wrangling process. A define field created as part of this process is available whenever the master file is used, while a define field created when creating a chart or report will only be available for that chart or report. The other type of virtual field is a compute, which is calculated after everything else has been aggregated. Computes use very few resources and are the only way to use prefix operator aggregations, such as the average or median operator, or to create a temporary field from joined data. However, they can only be used as sum fields, not as by fields, and appear immediately in your chart or report rather than the data tree. Computes are great for creating numeric fields that can be quickly calculated for your chart or report. For example, maybe you want to make a new field to see the average revenue for each sale, which you can calculate by dividing the values in the revenue field by the associated values in the sale units field. To calculate this field, Navigate to the Data tab and click Summary Compute. Just add the Revenue field to the editor by double-clicking it. Click the Divided By symbol, then add the Sale Units field. You don't need to change the field format because it is a numeric field with two numbers after the decimal point by default. Name the field and click OK. The computed field appears in the report, and you can rename the column to your preference. When you run the report, you will see that both the define field and the compute field contain information synthesized from pre-existing fields in the data source. You can use defines and computes to make more advanced temporary fields with the ability to create complex numeric, alphanumeric, and date and time fields. Learn more using the resources in our Information Center.